Hello Internet, it is me, the man, and welcome back to No Time. So in the last episode, we successfully installed a fusion reactor into our car, and we talked to Author, who gave us a special secret covert mission to go back to the old facility he used to work at and prevent the time agents from stealing the blueprints to a suitcase that can hold things on the inside bigger than the outside. So we have to go to June 7th, 1989 at, I don't know, 12 in the afternoon. That should give us enough time. Bam. All right, cool. Uh, I need fuel for the car, though, because I can't just slap that uranium rod in again. Oh, sorry, guy. Whoa. Okay. Oh. Oh, there we go. Okay, I was, I was worried that I was going to be stuck there. So I have $11. I hope that's enough to buy a fusion core. Uh enough to buy one of the other ones oh it's twenty dollars nuts okay well i'll have to make some money be right back okay so i made a little bit of money and i bought a fusion cell so now everything should be fine let's go back to the past so i should teleport by the end of this road and then the facility should just be right there there we go. Bam. Ah, there. It looks much less abandoned now. So I wonder if the time agents will have already arrived at this point. Doesn't look like it. It used to be that you fought the time agents right upon arriving here. I want to turn on my cooling systems. Yeah, I don't see anybody. Let's pull around the back. Is there still a time fragment back here? There used to be a time fragment back here don't see it anymore okay so I can sneak on in through there or I can walk in through the front door so let's try to be a little bit sneaky maybe although we did get the key can I how do I it's like alt to crouch there we go all right bow 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 sneak right on through here we go into a supply closet all right so this is already a little bit different than how it used to be. It's a much more detailed interior of the building here. It's a lot of... Oh. oh, hey! Can I not... Can I not shoot... Can I not shoot the gun? Oh, it's like I'm too too close to him. There we go. Ah. Alright. Reload. There we go. It's like I was too... I was in close quarters combat. I couldn't... Uh, I couldn't target... I couldn't use the gun. You think you heard something? Anyone in this room? Check your corners. Oh, there's a bunch of guys. Why can't I use the gun? Oh, there. Okay, that's why. Am I reloaded? There we go. Well, they teleport a lot faster after being knocked out than they used to, because it used to be they would sit on the floor for a while. Intruder's notes. Let's pick those up. What do these say? Your orders are clear. Retrieve the secret plans to their latest work and capture that dreaded scientist. He has been a thorn in my eye for a long time. He has he was also behind their successful escape with the time machine from C. Is there a second page? P.S. Make sure it is the right scientist. He has a bad style of fashion and usually wears goggles and a mustache. He wears a mustache. Be on your watch. He seems to have advanced self-defense skills. P.P.S. Make sure to capture him alive. He is an old adversary of mine. I will plan my revenge on him personally. In case of some intervention of his colleague, we will initiate Operation Hydra Eye. Okay, that's it. Well, that was that's exciting. All right, cool. Well, unfortunately, I um, annihilated those guys. Oh, there was another one. Uh, wait, what happened to the gun? Did I, did I drop my gun? I did. Shoot. Reload. Bam, headshot. Okay, he survived the headshot. There we go. Reload. I'm going to have to try to upgrade this as soon as possible, because reloading after every shot is obnoxious. Okay, uh, inventory that. So we got some books. Oh, okay, that's just the guard that I, I got rid of. Ooh! Let's try, let's have some coffee. Let's just take a little bit of a coffee break. Mm -hmm. Interdimensional coffee, lovely. Yeah, this is a much more detailed interior than it used to be. There's author. There's the microwave. That is terrifying. All right, let's just try to... 
sneak up. I didn't mean to press the Windows key. All right, let's try to sneak up on author here. Can I not? Can I not? Oh, that's locked. Okay. Fine. So what's over here? Door needs the key. There's the blueprint. New tool, object to craft. So that must be the... That must be what I came here... Oh! What in the world? Oh! You're alive! Is the time machine safe? Yes, and I have been sent from the future. Looks in the direction of the safe. Uh, with a raised eyebrow. To steal my work? Sigh. It is good seeing you, buddy, but what do you need my confidential work for? You sent me to retrieve your work. Why? These agents were about to steal it themselves. Agents? The same ones who invented the, invaded, the li invaded the lab complex in 84? You were targeted as well, but... But then you came to stop them. I get it. Well, then we need to get you out of here. Is the time machine safe? I think. All right. Oh, and by the way, does the future have flying cars? I, I wonder. No time for that now. No time for that now. Okay, okay, I get it. I should not know too much about the future. I was just curious. I will escort you to the machine then. We need to hurry. Okay. All right. Well, first of all, I want to get that this thing. Yoink! And I'm not going to touch that. This does not look stable. It is an oversized mag... Is that an oversized magnometer? It is, too. That is terrifying. Don't want to make my craft dinner in that, that's for sure. Okay, um, I guess I'll go downstairs. Oh, there's a guy. Mr. President, get down! There we go. Nailed him. Alright, let's reload. What the heck is this thing? Is that a Hydron Collider? No, author, look out, he's got a gun! Alright, I think we're clear. What is this thing? I want to inventory that. I don't think I can interact with this at all. All right. Well, so much for avoiding talking to author, but hey, whatever. Uh, all right. Well, I parked out back, so. The Manhofer Institute. Doodly doo doo. Where's the car? There's the car. All righty. Whoa. I don't, know, I, I don't know what's up with that. I don't know why it keeps doing that. Oh, I have a little bit of a time bounty now, so that's something. Okay, here I am at the car. Oh, is that a glass floor pad? I don't think I noticed that before. That's kind of cool. All right, well, here I am. The time machine! I guess this is it, then. We will see each other in the future. Hope it won't be too long, friend. No worries, dude. It's It's about 20 years, but it's fine. I guess I'll make some microwave pizza then. I am a bit hungry. You earned your tasty pizza. Eat it cold, it tastes better. Oh. Ooh. This is... This... Oh, we have a text tree choice here. Mmm. I do like cold pizza in the morning, but... You earned your tasty pizza, man. Thank you, buddy. See you in the future. Aye. All right, cool. That was a fun little interaction. I like that. Uh, this is still at 100%, so I should be safe to go back to April 25th, 2014 at 12 in the afternoon. Bam! Zwam, bam, thank you, ma'am. See you in about 25 years, buddy. If I could get over the curb. There we go. It's fine. All right, cool. Let's just turn on this street here. There we go. Back when it had a parking lot that was above ground. I forgot to turn the reactor on. Oh, and then I smacked into that. Come on. Come on. There we go. Zbiaow. Oh, alright, cool. Back in the future. So let's cool that reactor down. Alright. You know, I wonder it, how that the time resetting thing is happening, because I haven't really experienced that yet. Where the more... What? Pizza author. <laughs> and then don't come again! You don't like my pizza! Ah! Did he just kick that lady out? Alright, well this is very different. Huh. Okay. All right. There's the Mr. Crafty I left behind. 
Oh, I guess the time reset did happen, but... Hey, author. Pizza author. Okay. Ugh, ah, pizza boy, come back! Uh, what? It's me, pizza author. You have new things to do now, eh? What? What? what ha I got an achievement for this. What happened to you? I'm having... Oh, I having a new haircut. That... That's that's not proper English. No, wrong. My hairstyle, not English. Do, do you remember me? Na 1989, the the facility. Facility. Hmm. I remember pizza. I like pizza. Now do your job, eh? Ed Edward, you're an inventor. Yes, I invent delicious pizza. Want some? What? What do you need? What do you need me for? I need pizza delivery. Get uh the get the, get eh uh, the EPA eh uh. the the EPA I remember it but for pizza delivery electromagnetic pizza accelerator <laughs> Okay, fade. What are you looking? What are you looking this way? Here, take mine if you lost. What what is the first thing that, that what is the first thing that you remember? Pizza in microwave. They said microwave went explosion. Oh my god, dude. I should have told him to eat it cold. I should have told him to eat it cold. The, the microwave exploded. What have I done? I've changed the future. You lost your memory? Any road, I have another task. Which task? Ah, my old adversary, Francesco, across town square. You need to challenge for grand battle. <laughs> What? <laughs> He's stealing my customers. We, you will use ancient ritual for battle initiation. It hands you over some raw pizza dough. Here, take this and slap pizza bot Francesco with pizza dough ball. <laughs> okay. Okay. Ciao. I should have told him to eat it cold. I didn't, I didn't think the microwave would kill him. Dude. What have I done? I wonder if I told him to eat it cold, if, if all of this would have... None of this would have happened. Let's put that in our inventory. All right. All right, Francesco, I'm coming to get you. Can I drink this soda can? Oh, hey, the toucan drink. I remember you. Hey, pizza bot. Yeah. Is that what I... Is this... There we go. I think I did it enough. Oh. He's angry. What? Oh my god. Dude! What is happening right now? Oh my god. Francesco, I challenge you! Pizza Arthur, this has been the last time that you were bothering me with your ig indignant something. Prepare to meet your match. Oh, he's gonna shoot him with a laser. Yeah, I have an electromagnetic pizza accelerator. Prepare to be junk. Your move. Your move. <laughs> what? What? That's a microwave with a funnel and it shoots pizza? Your move. What is happening right now? Are they doing anything? <laughs> Your move! Uh, is something supposed to be happening right now? <laughs> uh, ah, pizza boy, welcome back! Is that... Your move? Are they supposed to be fighting right now? What's happening? The pizza author. This is getting out of hand. I need to head back to the facility. Oh, okay. In 1989, after I left. I need to warn Edward not to use that dreaded microwave. As in, never. Okay, so they don't, they don't actually fight. All right, I thought they were going to start shooting lasers at each other. All right, I'll leave them in their little stalemate here. All right, so I got to recharge my... <laughs> that was crazy, man. I got to recharge my uh, my uranium core here. Or not uranium, my fission core. There we go. There's the recharger. Let's just stop right there. Okay, uh pull you out chunk you right in there refuel please 
Thank you, Fusion Fuel Station. Oh, this takes longer than I remember. There we go. All right, cool. Pick that up. Smack that in there. And let's go back. So right after I left, eh? So where did I come from? Where did I go? So 06, 07, 1989. Uh, let's just go to... Ah, uh, like right after. 14, 4, 8. One minute should do it. There we go. Uh, that's probably enough time for us to warn him about the microwave. Uh, I want to turn on the reactor. Here we go. Whoopsie doodles. They are they still duking it out? Probably. Yep, there they are. Don't mind me. <laughs> Be right back. Do, 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 do. Oh no! I got curbed. My plans were curbed. Okay. Fine, I'll drive around the parking lot like a loser. There we go. Ugh. Perfect. Okay. This should be enough of a straightaway that I should be able to get where I'm going. Perfect. All right, there we go. Turn on that reactor cooling right away. It's a good habit to get in. All right. Ugh, this curb, dude. There we go. All right, quick. Quick. Author, no! Can I get out of the car while it's still driving? I can. There we go. Eh. It needs a key. I have the key. It's fine. Author! Get away! Step away from the microwave! Ugh. No! It's gonna blow! <laughs> oh, you're back, buddy! Do listen! Do not use the microwave! Uh, uh, why? You will lose your memory. Oh. And turn into a pizza fanatic fighting a giant robot. <laughs> No, wait, what? You need to get rid of that thing safely. <laughs> all right, all right. Now, how about we shoot it or throw it or throw it at something from a distance? Is that is that the right is that the right place to do this? <laughs> this room is fireproof. Go ahead. Dude, do I get to shoot the explosive microwave? <laughs> what about your TV, dude? <laughs> what about your old CRT? I hope there's nothing flammable in those boxes. All right, cool. Open my journal. The facility. Uh, I need to throw or shoot at the microwave. All right. This is how I solve all my problems. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Absolutely obliterated. Cool. Okay. Hey, author. I I guess that is it, right? Oh yeah. One thing. What is it? Make sure to send me back. Make me make sure to send me back here to save you. Ah, sure. Anyway, see you in the future. Haha. -ha. All right, cool. All right, you have a nice 25 years, buddy. I'll see you in a couple minutes. For me, anyway. Can we interact with these computers? Uh, there's one new mail message. Edward, I want my coffee. Finish that Mr. Coffee apparatus. Okay. Uh, what about entry logs? Nothing. Okay, let's just shut you down. Alrighty. Oh yeah, sorry dude, I parked in the middle of the street. It was an emergency, don't worry about it. Alright, uh, let's go back to April 25th, 2014 at 14.16. Bam! Alright, cool. Do I have my reactor on? I do now. Are we at a safe heat? We are. Alright, and away we go! Well, I should at least get around the corner before I start accelerating. There we go. Alright, hopefully everything will be back to normal now. That was crazy, dude. I was not prepared for Pizza Arthur. Our author, not Arthur. Added an extra R there. Alright, cool. It's fine. Just a little bit of property damage. Never hurt anybody. Uh, reactor cooling. There we go. ER Author Laboratory, just like it's supposed to be. Hey, I'm back. Oh, well, where are you? I am at the courthouse archives. Meet me there. Can I pick this up? I don't think I can. Okay. 
So this whole part of the first act is completely different. Uh, I think that has probably been long enough, so we're going to go into the court archives on the next episode. I hope you really enjoyed this, because I know I did. That was hilarious. And uh, yeah, thank you so much for watching, and I hope to see you again on the next episode real soon. Goodbye!